Cristiano Ronaldo has scored 855 goals throughout his illustrious football career. Today, I'm going to be recreating the best goal he's scored for each club he's played at. And for every goal I successfully managed to recreate, a prize is added to the football mystery box I'll be giving away at the end of the video. So let's go all the way back to 2002, where he made his professional debut for Sporting Lisbon. Right, so Cristiano only scored five goals for Sporting, and the footage wasn't the best, but this was undoubtedly his best goal scored when I was just two years old. Okay, so it's a little step over round the defender and then almost a little dink over the keeper into that bottom left corner. Oh, and I didn't mention I've only got 10 minutes of attempts for each goal, so we best get straight into it. Nope. Get out. So I definitely felt like I could do this with a lot of time to spare, but I just wanted to get that finish right into the far corner for a full recreation. And on my fifth attempt, I present to you the first goal of the video. Oh, yeah. So that is the first prize added to the mystery box for you guys, and we're just warming up. I think this is where the world really started seeing the mainstream introduction of stepovers and seeing more flair being introduced to the game. And this next goal has got flair written all over it. So after jumping on the scene for Sporting Lisbon, Ronaldo then got his first ever international cap for the Portuguese national team soon after. So let's take a look at this next goal for Portugal. My needs had a zero to this 10 minutes. Let's get in the box. All right, so I need a fast delivery, Amazon Prime. I'll be running in and stop around here. And it's like a half volley, flick into the bottom corner. But for the goal to count, it has to bounce after it's past the line. Time's ticking, let's go. Now this one was much harder than I thought, not only because of the flick, but also the passes had to be so accurate because an inch two in front of me, I wouldn't get there. And an inch two behind me, and the ball would get stuck in my feet. Oh, come on, Ronaldo, I know you're watching. This one's on me. Mate, you couldn't finish hot meal. As time went on, I was starting to pick up the technique more and more, and even nearly produced some absolute screamers. I then started to develop this spin technique because it helped me get some momentum and power onto my flip, and also look super cool. Oh, and a minute later, I managed to produce this. Now at first, I thought this was it and I'd actually won up to the goal, but after a quick VAR check, I wasn't sure it was good enough. I still had a few minutes to spare, so I decided to carry on and really focus on getting the power onto my flick and run into the ball a bit more. Oh, I just know it's there. It's coming, it's coming, come on. I felt like I was really picking up the technique and then all of a sudden, things started to click. Now I ain't comparing myself to Ronaldo, but come on, that was pretty good. Now what next is where things start to get really tested. Ronaldo joined Man United in 2003, and to be fair, I shouldn't have to introduce or even show you this clip for you to know what it is. But if you need reminding, feast your eyes on this. Yeah, the video would not be complete without this goal, so the mannequins are ready. I'm ready, so let's give it a go. Now this is where I really started to struggle because my go-to technique has always been curl. Before this, I don't even know if I've ever even tried a knuckleball in my life. But with the first few goals complete, I had a bit of confidence about me. I want to put my knuckle through this ball in a minute. Ooh, you're hard. Although I was hitting some decent shots, they just weren't knuckleballing like Ronaldo's goal. Oh, it's Ronaldo. Yes, run. More knuckle, I know I'm trying. Why does it have to be so good? It's making my video tear ages. Had to hang up on him. Come on, let's carry on. Slowly but surely, I was actually starting to pick up the knuckleball technique within the 10 minutes. But scoring with this technique into the top corner seemed a long way away. Oh, I need some nachos for that dip. Now, with only a minute left, I decided to take my time and tunnel vision concentrate on the goal that Ronaldo did. And what you're about to see is perhaps one of the best goals I've ever scored in my life. Where has that come from? I guess that's a third prize secured. Sometimes I even surprise myself. It's a shot of superlatives. Many better than this fly past him. 
Now, from one goal that made the history books to another, this time for his next club, Real Madrid. And again, you probably know which one's coming. Which would you say is more iconic, the last one or this one? Right, crush mat will definitely be needed if I want to be able to walk home today. Bicycle kick, bottom right, you know the drill by now. Let's do this. Oh. Too slow. Ooh, getting closer. Ooh. Oh. 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 Wrong side. Oh. I promise I'm not paying the keeper. On your bike. I think my bike's broken, mate. Ooh. I'm my back. Oh. Now my bicycle kicks were fully warmed up. On my next attempt, I produced something special. Oh, mate, it's two top corner. What more can I do? Two top corner. This is the worst thing about recreations. So I kept going in the hope that I'd get a lucky nope. shot into the bottom corner. But with each attempt, I felt myself gaining more confidence in my jump. Oh, it's coming. I can picture the edit now. And then Ronaldo. One's good enough for you. Yeah, that's fine. Four from four prizes. Not bad going, I don't think. But now it's time to check out the next goal. Now, after being at Real Madrid for almost 10 years, Ronaldo then moved to Juventus in 2018 and managed to produce this power strike as the winning goal. Right, so that's what I need you. It's time to take the bins out. Let's go. Goal number five. Here we go. This guy's ability is making my life so difficult right now. <laughs> Not a bad start. Nope. Oh. 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 What's that? Mate, if you do it, you've got to pull out the six pack celebration. To know if that celebration would be an exact recreation. How about if I do it, you've got to buy the mystery prize for this round. So I kept going and going and going and I thought this one might be harder than I first thought. But putting the target up gave me something to aim at and I definitely felt consistent with this shot. Oh, getting a bit fatigued now. Maybe I didn't think this challenge through. Come on, we've got two minutes left. Come on. Oh. Oh. <laughs> I'm on fire today. Oh, sorry, mate. It's the law of gravity. All things that go up must come down, especially with this right foot. On to the last one. So we have made it to the end of the video. Ronaldo's last club at the time of recording this video and probably sadly of his career is of course Al Nasser. It's another free kick, pick this one out. Right, so this one isn't actually top bins, but I'm feeling on form today, so let's see what happens. So this last one was a lot more suited to my technique, so I just had to find my range. I was feeling good about this one, but couldn't get too comfortable, as we're starting to get really fatigued with every shot I was taking. So to complete this shot, I had to do it pretty soon. Oh, I've only got a few more attempts in me now. Whoever wins this mystery box better enjoy it. I'm ticking, mate. Oh, come on. If I score the other free kick, I can score this one. Let's make it two from two. Come on. Oh, my Lord. So after that shot being whiskers away, I knew this was possible. And for my last attempt, I had to give it everything I had. Yes, I have done it. What a challenge. That is six out of the six prizes secured into the mystery box for you guys. If you want to win, like the video and go download my new game, Ben Nuttall's Football Wipeout on the App Store or Google Play Store and comment to let me know when you've done it. I hope you guys enjoyed and I'll see you in the next challenge.